and welcome back to my channel. This is Coach Michelle Hong. I am so excited because I posted last week my Trader Joe's haul video. And now I'm gonna show you what I do with the food that I got. And I'm gonna show you how to make an easy breakfast or an easy snack before or after your workout or your practice. And I love acai bowls. They were such a treat. Like I would be able to get a Jamba Juice acai bowl maybe after a competition or something special but this is something that you can do at the comfort of your home and for a very affordable price. Usually when you go to Jamba Juice, you'll pay like $7 or something like that to get a bowl where you can just make these at home for a fraction of the cost and you can make multiple of them over a span of a month or so. So I'm so excited to show you my recipe and I would love to show you more. Don't forget to like this video if you're interested in more recipes and don't forget to subscribe for more videos to come. Love you all and let's get into it. All right, so we're gonna get started by adding our ingredients. And what I love to add first are the frozen foods. So I have the strawberries here. And I'm putting this much into it. And I love this blender, by the way. This is the Ninja Blender. I'm gonna put a link for it below so that you can get it on Amazon. Super convenient. And it has like, it just has three buttons and you'll see it. Um, low, medium, and high. And I use it almost every day. I try to make like a smoothie or an acai bowl um, to jumpstart my morning and it is so convenient. And then I froze these blueberries because they were getting um, close to the end of its lifespan. So I was like, oh, I need to save these. So I put them in the freezer. So we're gonna put a handful of these in. I love blueberries. They're one of my favorite fruits to just snack on. Super, super uh, fun. They're like poppable. Um, I think of them like bobas. <laughs> I really like boba too. So this is acai um, and it comes in a pack like this. So I'm gonna cut it open and you freeze them. So some people might ask like, what is acai? So I'm gonna read the backing of this label right here. Acai is a purple berry born of the Amazon rainforest and is widely considered one of the most nutritious foods on the planet. It's delicious, exotic, cocoa berry flavor is perfect is the perfect base to your favorite blended acai or smoothie. Um, it has a ton of antioxidants. It's full of omegas and it has a load of minerals and nutrition. So I always hear great things about acai. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. <laughs> All I know is it's purple and it tastes good in my smoothies and in my bowls. So let's cut this up. Um, Maybe get some scissors. So I'm gonna cut this. And so it comes in a pack like this. So it comes like frozen. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna heat up some water so that I can melt this a bit. Um, let's heat up some water. Awesome. So I cut this up. So I plop the acai in there. Looks like this. Looks like a fruit roll up, fruit leather. And then I'm gonna add some Greek yogurt. Greek yogurt. And then of course, I can't forget to add spinach. Spinach is so easy to incorporate into my smoothies and in my bowls so that I can get my vegetable intake in. Honestly, I just load it in there because I have a lot of fruit in there so it's just to balance out. 
Um, and this makes several servings, which is great because then I can save it. I like to put them in containers and save them for the rest of the day or a snack the next morning. Um, and then we're gonna add some almond milk. Almond milk. Do, 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 do. Then from here, I add on my cup. And the rest of the ingredients, I save for later. So I wait for, um, like, I wanna put the bananas in on top later. And same with my sunflower seed um, and my granola. So we're gonna plug the blender in. Do, 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 do. Lock it in. And all mixed up. Okay, from here, sometimes there's a little bit of spinach left on the top. So, I like to shake it up one more time before we... difficulties. I put the cap on wrong. So I'm trying to show you guys the fun. All right. Blend. So the purple color is kind of gone because we put a lot of spinach in it, but that's okay. So the next thing that we're gonna add is this granulous granola that I got from Trader Joe's in my Trader Joe's haul that you heard about last week. It is awesome. It has almonds, coconut, sunflower, pumpkin seeds, and they're clustered together to make this salty sweet treat. And then we can enjoy this like at any time. If you wanna just grab some and eat them, you can, but I love to put these on my bowls. So we're gonna place this bowl here so you can see. Um, like, look at this. <laughs> this is a giant cluster. I'm totally gonna just snack on this. I'll save it for the side. And then I'm gonna add my granola right on top. Do, 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 do. So pretty. And then I love adding the banana. I like how this is already peeled. It just split right off. Boop, boop, boop. And then I'm gonna cut it all prettily. And you know like when you make food look good, then it makes it so much more satisfying to eat. So I'm gonna try to make it like Jamba Juice where they put the banana on the outside. Make a little halo. Like that. So that's my acai bowl. And I wanna present it to you. Ta-da! So cute. It's not purple. It looks kinda greenish, but that's okay. It still tastes good. So let me get a try. Scoopity doo. This is good. The only mistake that I had was that I made it more of a smoothie and then a bowl. I need to do less vanilla almond milk next time. So I need to perfect my ratio. Um, but sometimes I go between smoothies and acai bowls and I, I'm not thinking sometimes. 
So I was like splashing in the almond milk, like, woo, yeah, let's go. And then I wasn't looking at the measurement. So if you want to make an acai bowl, try to go less on the liquid that you use, whether it be almond milk, coconut milk, or whatnot. And regardless, still tastes great. I love the granola clusters. They're so fun. That was awesome and fun and delicious. And I want to continue getting more into like finding fun ways to make eating healthy, nutritious, and exciting all at the same time. Um, because that's one of my goals. I explained to you all that I'm really working on my health, my fitness, and my wellness in terms of making sure that I'm nourishing my body, remembering to eat. Like sometimes that's one of the things that I neglect on my own, where it's like, I don't remember to eat because I'm so busy, but that's not a good excuse. I wanna make sure that I'm putting in time slots where I'm going breakfast, lunch, dinner. And when I make smoothies like this, or I make acai bowls like this, I have another serving left. So what I do is I like to put this into containers or mason jars. So I'll show you right here. I have these cute mason jars. I have small ones and I have larger ones. And so what I could do is I could pour my, what was intended to be an acai bowl, <laughs> but I could be a smoothie that I can have for the next morning. So I'm super excited to share this with you all. And I hope that you enjoyed this video. So let me know in the comment section below what type of recipes or you know ideas for breakfast, lunch, or dinners you would want. And I love you all so much. And I'll see you in my next video. So with that being said, have a great day. And I'll catch you next time. Bye.